Uh, my name is Ed Bernat, and I'm the principal here at St. John Paul II Academy. And um, in my role as principal, I'm responsible for the day-to-day uh, -day academic operations of our school. Our student body is uh, approximately 400 students. And being a small school that's grades 9 through 12, uh, we are able to, you know, to really pride ourselves on smaller class sizes. So our average class size is 22, a little less than 22. Um, and we have a student to teacher ratio of 14 to 1. Um, so that being said, we really take advantage of the opportunity to know students individually um, and believe that in the long run over those four years that we'll have them, they're going to be better off because we get to know them and their individual needs better. Hello, my name is Jerry and uh, I'm from China, uh, Shandong. And uh, I've been here starting for two years, and uh, I'm in 11th grade now. So my name is Kwabina Asamobu, and I'm from Ghana, Accra, as a city, and I'm 18 years old. I'm Bailey Grimberg, and I'm 15 years old. I'm a sophomore here at St. John Paul, and I'm from Dallas, Texas. At St. John Paul, I really like that there are small classes, and the teachers are able to focus on each student. I'm Clay England. I'm from Chicago, Illinois, and I've been here for four years. Senior. I feel like we're just like one big family at St. John Paul II. In recent years, we've had students go to the military academies, whether it be the Naval Academy, the Air Force Academy, uh, Notre Dame, Georgia Tech. Uh, we have a, a recent graduate who's at Columbia. Um, and just here in state, you know, we have the 14th ranked university in the world, the University of Florida, uh, and that's where our uh, valedictorian from last year went. Being a small school, um, I think sometimes there's a tendency to think that we don't have as many uh, programs, uh, but our, our we have a wide variety of athletic offerings um, and a growing number of extracurricular offerings as well. One of the ones I think I'd really like to talk about is, is our robotics program. Uh, our robotics program in the last three years has tripled in size in terms of student participation. And it's something that we have, uh, as a school, have, have made an additional commitment to because we've seen the growth. And we know from research that these, the math and science skills that they're learning, participating in this, um, are skills that colleges are looking for. This marks my 23rd year in secondary education. And I can say without exaggeration that working with the Amerigo team um, has been the, one of the most professional experiences um, every member of the team that we've interacted with uh, from the top down um, has been top notch. And as we've continued through the process, and, and we've really been in the process for over a year now, it has been um, every step that we've taken has reinforced our decision to continue with this partnership. Um, and one of the reasons we're all so excited about it is because we know that the quality of people we're dealing with uh, is so high. And what people associate us with here is that we are a community, all right? And we look out for one another in all sorts of different ways. And with the students right now, our student body is at the right size. We know everybody. No one falls through the cracks. Go Eagles! Go Eagles!